I'm sure for the athletes, for the supporters, for all of the hard work that's gone in behind the scenes over the last seven years. To all of the Solomon Islanders tuning in overseas, this is our home nation. There we have the football women, you know, the, the parade, Seamus and Brendan, they are split into separate groupings in their federations.
also not to mention coming through COVID and uh, some of the other challenges that are faced with uh, the athletes and also the staff and working group who have pulled this together and now it is happening, the opening ceremony. So yes, it's a celebration indeed, not only for Solomon Islands but for the Pacific as we, as you mentioned earlier, Brendan, the uh, of the culture, the colours, it's the flag. It's profound, don't you think, Lisa? I really do. It's just punching through these pictures, just the, the, the cultural links across the Pacific, and there she is again. What a shot! What a champion! And she's acknowledged by the crowd. What a life for her! Extraordinary journey! What a journey for Solomon Islands!
language which unites the Solomon Islands. Nearly 70 languages. An unknown number of cultures. Unified by pigeon. This very famous trip reigns out around the Solomon Islands. To say a blessing for the 2023 Pacific Games by the chairman of the Solomon Islands Christian Association, Reverend Dr. Edward Polohai. And to all of the participants, we will welcome the president of the Association Christian of the Isle Salomon. We welcome the chairman of the Solomon Islands Christian Association, Reverend Dr. Edward Polohai. and loving God we thank you for the opportunity of being here today the day that we longed for anticipated we thank you for your care and your love and thank you for bringing our Pacific neighbors brothers and sisters to our source we welcome with God's love our friends, brothers and sisters. May we engage in good sportsmanship in the coming two weeks. Be with us, Lord, as we come to open these Pacific Games officially. We ask for his blessing upon these sports and these games in this coming days. Bless our leaders who are here with us today and bless those who watch from, from, the, from the corners of our Pacific nation, the Pacific Ocean. Be with us as we celebrate, challenge and unite as the theme for these Pacific Games. Be our hearts, be open to share with one another the love, the gospel of Jesus Christ in our engagement, in our sportsmanship. May we promote God's kingdom as he will continue to bless us with wonderful gifts of life. And be with us in these days that are coming. We pray and uplift and ask God's blessing to be upon these Pacific Games, the 17th Pacific Games, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Levons-nous pour saluer le drapeau et l'hymne national des Îles Salomon. National anthem Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the national anthem of the Solomon Islands and the raising of our nation's flag.
national anthem there. The flag is raised, the seat is set. Shortly we will be treated to a performance of unity and diversity. As the choir leaves the stage, the canoes move towards the middle. They will form on the motif of a turtle. Turtles holding significant cultural, spiritual and ecological importance in many Pacific Island cultures. They are revered as symbols of navigation, longevity and guardianship. They often feature traditional myths, stories, rituals and arts. Fitting the mascot of the you may 2023 sit. Pacific Games, Solo the Turtle will be with us shortly as these canoe structures assemble <laughs> we will be treated to a series of performances <laughs> presenting <clears throat> for regional areas of the Solomon Islands Lisa and now just uh, in the centre stage there we have the Central Islands dancers. We've also got the Makira. There's Renal and Belona dancers also on center stage. Which each provinces representing Solomon Islands will get the chance.